Alright, this is Don with ATR Country Licks, and I'm going to teach you some basic country licks all the way to advanced country licks. Everything from chicken picking, hammer ons, pull offs. And uh, today, we're going to do one in the key of A. And I'm going to teach it to you, and it can be used in the key of G. We use C, D, whatever chord you want to go to. But if I'm in the key of A, I'm going to teach you a little chicken picking. Like when I'm playing A. Alright, and it's a little simple thing. You're going to slide. You're going to slide your middle finger all the way to the 6th fret on the 3rd string up and then you're going to pluck the E on the bottom string on the A note and then what you're going to do is you're going to go one more fret on the 3rd finger and then lay your finger down on the bottom string of the E and you're going to pluck it and then you're going to slide two more frets with the same hand movement. And then you're going to come back. Then you're going to go back to the very beginning. See, usually when you do this, now you can go, or you can even run this lick backwards. But now we're going to chicken pick a little bit, so we're going to mute the strings with your right hand. So you can really chicken pick it too. It gives you more of that chicken picking sound. So you can do a variety of stuff with that A. But if I'm going to come up to a G, I can do it from a G. If I'm, just say if I'm playing in G, if this chord uh, quit buzzing. And if I want to do it in A, I just go up to the A, just like your A chord on the fifth fret, whatever your top note is, that B, open E, F, G, A, B, C, and D, and whatever that top note is, and I'm on it on the bottom one, I can do it, like if I'm in G, if I'm in A, I'll... If I want to go to B, if I'm going to play it in B, or if I want to go to D, but again, another thing, you can play this thing all the way back from a D to a G too. So if you're in a D, you could easily. So you go. So this is just an easy chicken leg for people that's a beginner. But like I said, if you're going, you know, from the D, you can go from the D all the way back to the G. And you can focus on this and do so much with this lick. Like, if you're playing with some people and you don't really know no country licks and they over here and you want to make a good impression on this player. See, you can skip every other one or you can go well, rotate it all the way instead of going every other one. I'd be going every other one. This would be rotating it. Later on, I'm going to teach you some more licks, like in the key of A. You know, I learned some fancy licks like that.
Well, first of all, we gotta stick with the basics and learn all this little chicken picking stuff. Stuff that'll get you through if you're playing with someone and want to impress them. And plus, it's really old. It's a old country style of playing. You know, I use it a lot. I, you know, I use a lot of feeling. You know. Just a lot of chicken picking. So, maybe you learned something from this and just hit like and let me know, you know, how you like it. And like I said, I'm with ATR Country Licks and we're going to get the basics down for you. And we're going to cover a lot of stuff on this guitar. On your guitar, the first thing you need to learn, we're going to get into music theory where you're going to learn all your strings. You're going to learn how to pick good, learn how to do slides, hammer-ons, all different stuff. So I'm going to teach you some country, blues, rock and roll, southern rock, you know, a little bit of everything. But right now I'm trying to get you through the basics of learning how to play. Next time we'll cover some more country. Stuff like that. And, you know, we'll go on to the D and I'll teach you how to... Every lick I do, I'll teach you how to do it in different chords, too. So, just stay tuned and hit like and let me know what you think. Thank you.